The Maple Grove Fire Department has new tools to help them with water rescues. The department recently purchased two new rescue boats. This week, firefighters started training with them, and we had the opportunity to get an up-close look. Everybody's driven a boat before? Familiar with bolts? Every job requires training and repetition. There's two trim switches on this. There's one on the motor. Once the battery's on, which is over here on this switch. And that's especially true for the ones that involve saving lives. If you're going to go in for a rescue, you want to definitely have this on. Earlier this year, when we took it out last time, we had four or five guys in here. It's pretty comfortable. The Maple Grove Fire Department purchased two new boats to help them become better equipped to handle a water rescue. Push it down to release. These just pop off real quick. One is an 18-foot aluminum rescue boat. Ready? One, two, three. And the other is a 14-foot inflatable Zodiac boat. All right, let's slide. Which is designed for getting onto bodies of water without an easy access point. There you go. You just got to watch those wheels, right? This is the department's opportunity to get everyone trained on the new equipment. Everything that we do in the fire service, it comes down to training and repetition. Um, we don't want the first time that a firefighter uses this equipment to be during an emergency. So we want to make sure they have a chance to familiarize themselves with the equipment. Keep coming, keep coming. After familiarizing themselves with the equipment, the firefighters practiced using the boats at nearby Weaver Lake. Our new boat combination gives us a larger boat for lakes like Weaver Lake and Eagle Lake, Fish Lake, and a smaller boat that's a little bit more portable that we can take into places that don't have good access. Unlike the 40-year-old boat they just replaced, this new, larger boat has a ladder ramp they can use to save multiple victims at a time. Any large body of water in Hennepin County, Sheriff's Water Patrol has the primary responsibility, but they're coming from Lake Minnetonka. So us having the boat here in town allows us to respond in a much more timely manner. Which makes having these boats available in town that much more important. The hope is that they never have to deploy these watercraft. But should the need arise, they'll have the ability to get there quickly. Much of what we do in the fire department is practicing for emergencies and then hoping that we don't actually have to do the emergency. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.